Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the first episode of Fighting Dreamers. This is Master Star returning. Just call me Star, and I will be calling you active for this loving evening. We have ourselves an exciting card tonight. <laughs> Alright, our first match on the card is Reku Kanamoru versus Shinzaku Yamaga. Coming to the ring first is Reku Kanamoru. <laughs> Looking ready. You can't do a little Sailor Moon pose there for us. <laughs> She's ready to go to battle tonight. Let's see how. Let's, let's see what her opponent has to say about this. Well, not that, but. Here comes her opponent, Shinzaku Yama. The spotlight coming down. She got the swag going on now. Oh, the crowd does not approve of that. <laughs> she, let's see, uh, let's see which lady, let's see, she's coming to the ring too. Let's see how, let's see how, who will win this, is this our opening bout. An interesting referee for this uh, evening. Seems to be a knuckle cat of some sort, who knows. A lock up right now. Oh, break even. Oh, a little takedown right there. Lock up again. Irish rip. Didn't seem to really go anywhere. Oh, grab her, punches her in the face a little bit. He takes another, gets another shot in there. They gonna lock up again. There, who's gonna get the better choice? They break even again. Shinzaku do grapple, gets her, slams her head into the corner. Does he do anything with that? Reiko gets her, she wants it into the corner. Doesn't get anything off it. Shinzaku counters. They're just doing the same thing again and again. Oh, this time punches her into the corner, gets a drop it going. Grabs her head into the corner post. Locks her up. Oh, nice back body drop. Lock up again. Elbow to the back of the neck. Picks her up. Reiko wisely gets away. She misses a strike there. Lock up. Elbow to the back of the neck again. Oh, lock there. Half legged Boston Crab. And Rep couldn't get there in enough time to say give up or not. Reiko pops out of it. They lock up again. This should be it. break even. Even, excuse me. Reiko locks up and smacks her this time. Lock up again. They break even. The action has been high octane, very fast pace, ladies and gentlemen. Pretty much been even right now. Both ladies are canceling each other out. They're trying to go for lots of lockups here, trying to get the better of one another. Just not amounting to anything. I would try to go for a strike in this situation if there's just lots of lockups going on. Oh, there's an Irish whip. What he's gonna do here? Drop toe hold. Kicks her on the ground. Or gets a nice little stomp. Rams her into the corner. What's she gonna do? Locks up. Oh, it's gonna put her up to the up there on the top of the rope. What's she gonna go for? Spider driven suplex! That was excellent. Well executed right there by Reiko. She thought about something, but then said never mind. Oh! A quick low sweep right there. Tosses her into the ropes. Oh. Suzaku was able to catch her herself. Catch her, gives her a couple of shots to the face. Picks up again. Oh, Reiko gets the better of that one. Throws into the corner. Oh, Suzaku recovers. Tries to do a suplex. Reiko blocks it. Low, uh, a low kick. And then a, just a vicious sweeping of the legs. Just a sweep into the legs with a punch. Oh, it gets her in a... Had her in a lock there, but Reiko gets out of it once again. Oh, a low blow right in the JJ. That's gotta leave a mark. Oh, Shinzaku with a suplex going to the outside. Got a 20 count here. Oh, breakaway player. She got a chair. She's bitch like bitch please. You've been the fucking JJ. Here's a chair for your efforts. It seems she only got a nice little one swipe in there, but. but oh! Northern Light Suplex into a bridge. That's two. I didn't know it was a hardcore match, but hey, who cares? It's a hardcore match. Punch to the head. Oh, a, a couple more shots. Shizaku throws her into the corner. Oh, running front drop kick. Turns her around, goes for cover and a pin. One, and that's just all she's getting there. Oh, gets a chop to the ch across the chest. Shizaku locks up. Elbows into, the, elbows into the shoulder, it seems. Knee drop. Oh, a kick to the bread basket. Oh, a spinning heel kick. 
Another Nori Light Suplex by Reiko to Reiko's getting the better of Shizaku. Oh, STO! What? That's just two counts. Another two count. Reiko's a little bit exhausted. Didn't get up there as quickly. And, and, oh, I think it'd be seen up with like a knee drop or a fist drop. Picks it up. Scoop on the slam. Has I? She was a little bit too close to rope. I didn't know what that move was. Oh, nice little back body drop. Oh, nice spinning heel kick. They're very close to the outside. They almost seem like they're about to go outside, but never mind. Ray kicks her in the lower back. That's gonna leave a mark. Shazam tosses it off and gives her a nice little trip. And that is an STF. And you know she's been trying to lock in a submission, but you know it had, she hasn't been able to hold it long enough. And not know the lights, but this time she didn't hook, she didn't lock it in to get the pin. And since Zaku's dazed and confused, I I think she was. I think that must be knee to the lower back. Whoa, that was a close one though. And the ref said that she just barely has showed up. Ooh, it seems that a dial was stretching to a pump handle slam. Gets into a very interesting submission note. What is? That was a very interesting one right there. I don't know what that one was, ladies and gentlemen. A smack. Since Zaku's was dazed and confused, Rego comes in there and does a running kick to the gut. Oh, that's like a, it seems to be like a choke lock or a headlock of some sort, or a sleeper hold. Oh, it's actually a sleeper hold. I just remembered, sorry. Double arm, that's a double arm suplex. Pin, two, and that's she, that's her two count, actually. Oh, no. wrestling one on the German suplex. Another 2.9, very close. That was a German suplex, a low drop kick. Oh, grabbing from behind. Oh, elbows her. Oh, this is a very interesting one. Not sure what this one is. Oh, the ref got the. She actually, that was the first time the ref asked that she wanted to give up. Rick said no. A, a nice suplex out to the outside by Suzaku, though. Oh, Suzaku a little winded there. But she saw it seems to be alright. Let's see what they're gonna do here. Lock up again. Northern Lights. It's been an excellent match so far, ladies and gentlemen. STO! One, two. Oh, man. There's so many near falls. Oh, another kick to the bread basket. A running kick to the bread basket. Oh, a dragon soup. They didn't lock it, though. It was a dragon soup last, though. Excuse me. Locks up. Goes to the outside. I think we're gonna see something here. Is it gonna be a suicide dive? Oh, a free suicide dive! Right on the money, bumped it with her hand. This count's going very fast. It's a 20 count. Let's see what they're gonna do. Oh, she got a, she's not got a chair. She misses with the chair pathetically. Oh, a DDT onto the chair. Never mind. She landed perfectly. Oh, gets another interesting submission hold. Oh, a DDT. And Zaku picks her up. Oh, oh, that that very loose submission hole. It was locked in again. Rigo did once again refuses the tap. And Zaku get lands a couple shots to the face. Grabs her behind. What's she going for? And a domino stretch. Really close to the rope. But the refs had to say break. Oh, nice back body drop. Grabs her behind. A German suplex of her own. Oh, 2.9. The German suplex, a traditional move that all German women wrestlers know. Two, three. Excellent match right there by Rego. She takes it with the STO. Very well executed. Very well executed. Hey, our next match here is Sophie Sir. Serena and Maki Yueto versus Grizzly Yamato versus Olga Ashina. Coming out to the ring first is Sophie, Serena, and Maki Yueto. But we're just going to call Sophie and Maki. But that was an excellent match there, ladies and gentlemen. Reiko, at the last bit of, after kicking it out at a very well executed German suplex, he nails it with the STO. Very well done, and congratulations to Kanamoru for her victory. This is some tag team action here, though, folks. I forgot to mention this is a tag team action. All right, coming out next is Grizzly Yamato and Ogre. We're just gonna call them 
Grizzly, and uh, Ogre. Very interesting music for these ladies to come out to. They seem to have the height and the size advantage and the weight advantage too. So let's see how Sophie Serena and Mackie, how Sophie and Mackie are going to approach these, this tag team. The tag team mission here in Fighting Dreamers is very deep. So let's see what they want done. Let's see which team wants to get their names on the map first. It seems it's going to be a tornado tag. Oh, no, it's not. Okay, that's good. Traditional tag team rules. And another interesting referee. These referees and, and, and their choices of attire is very interesting. So, we have Sophie and Grizzly starting us off, starting us off ladies and gentlemen. Hey, lock up. Break even. Um, if I'm Sophie, I'll try to use my speed versus Grizzly. Oh, a scoop. Oh, a very powerful scoop in the slam. Sophie's going to try to pick up Grizz. Oh, gets her with a, um, a front suplex, it seems. Hey, lock up again. But if I'm Grizz, I'll try to use my power and this overpower Sophie. That body drop, very high one, very high octane, you know, moves by the Grizzly. Pops her in the corner, tosses into the road, but Sophie comes back and hits her with a knee. A clubbing blow to the back, and a leg drop to the back of the neck. Sophie throws into the ropes, and she sees it go for a drop, but Grizz saw it coming. Oh, coming from behind, a very, another very well skated, very high back body drop. Picks her up, kicks to the chest, grabs her, rams her head into the corner. Oh, Sobe counters and kicks her in the gut, gets her partner in there, she gets Mackie in there, and it wasn't a good idea because Grizz just kicked them both to the ground. And Sobe better just get out of here because she's not doing much good. Locking up again, breaking even. Mackie's going to try to, you know, see if she can overpower Grizz here. Oh, there's a shot in there. Oh, power drop, a tombstone, or a power driver, if you got and that will drop into a... Very odd pin, co pin combination. Oh, Maggie picks her up and gives her a powerful suplex. Punch to the gut. Misses the slap right there. Knees to the gut by Maggie. Throws her into the corner. That's not a good idea. And she knows that and she backs off wisely. And Grizzly tries to come with some kick, but she's missing. Grizzly throws her into the corner. Locks up. Oh, Maggie gives her a couple of shots to the gut and then knees to the, knees to the face. Very nicely done. Oh, good dodge right there by Grizzly. She told her into her corner, wrong side of town, but Grizzly for some odd reason backs off for no for no reason. That would have been a good time to get your partner in there and work the work Mackie over. Keep it in your side of town. That's basically tag team wrestling. Oh, nice. Another good suplex. She tried to go for a kick, but it misses. She tried Maggie tried to pick her up, but it didn't work. Grizzly blocks it and gives her a suplex of her own. They lock up again. Maggie gets a shot in there. Knees to the gut. Ooh, very hard. Drops to the mat. Uh, kick to the back. She gets her partner and Ogre in there. Oh. Maggie once again kicks them both down when they were trying to get a double team maneuver going, but it didn't work out. Oh, a beautiful suplex executed. Sending Maggie to the outside. But Ogre is going to try to win by count out. Oh, what's this? Is that actually going to be a ring bell of some sort, or... It, oh, both teams are mixing it up on the outside. It's getting wild in here. It's, it's just getting... The action here is just high out there. I see a spike bat. I see a chair. I see what seems to be like a, a table. I don't know what that all was, but it was a lot of stuff. And it seems this is also another tag team match with hardcore rules. Ogre kicks them both to the ground. She gets the chair. Oh, she tried to swing, but Sophie knocks her, knocks out of her hands. Ogre drops her on the head with a beautiful suplex. Wow. Goes for a cover in the pin. Wow. This is only a one count. Lock up. Throws her into her corner. Oh, grab. Oh, knees to the back. Lock up again. Whoa, what was that? It seemed to be someone sort of a choke slam. At the two, gets the two count. I gotta give it. I gotta give it the props to Grizzly and Ogre. They have dominated this match. Granted, Sophie and Mackie have had their flares of offensive. Oh, we got a spike bad. This is gonna hurt. Oh, hits her in the back. Oh my God, that spike bad. She better stay far clear from that. She gets it out of her hands. Oh, lock up. Sophie counters. 
gives a go around and gives her a few bumps with with her shoulder to her sh to Olga's shoulder. That didn't make sense. Sorry, folks. Oh, leg takeover. A, a, a little leg takedown. They mix it up in their side of town. I don't know if it's a smart idea for Sophie or not. Ogre picks her up. Oh, smacks. Jo oh, Ogre catches herself. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, oh, a, a very vicious backbreaker. She's calling for something, it seems. She gets the spike bat once again. Oh, she misses with the spike bat. So he wisely gets it out of her hands once again. A nice drop kick. Oh, lock up. Double. Oh, she tried to go for a double suplex. Oh, he says no. And she wanted to chip, but she dropped it. She wanted to spike bad. Oh, she hits her in the gut with that spike bad. Oh, kick to the gut by Sophie. Whoa. A beautiful hurricane round by the ogre. I didn't know so and so big has, has such great athleticism. Oh, nice lock up. Oh. Let's see what we got here. I see she's going for a kick, but a miss. She's trying to go for a double arm suplex. Ogre says, nope. Oh, she's on the top rope. Oh, a knee drop, it seems, from off the top rope. This Ogre's very impressive here. She's showing that she's just not all about the power game. She shows some athleticism, and she went to the top rope, too. That's very impressive. Ogre's mixing it up with Mackie on the outside. Mackie tried to go for a power bomb, but it didn't really seem to work. Oh, oh, Mackie with a beautiful elbow counter. Ogre's trying to go for something from behind. Matt goes for her, a drop kick but fails. Ogre should really stop worrying about Mackie and get back inside that ring. Ooh, a 12 count. Just barely get at, barely get back in there. Uh, that was not a good idea to go for a cover right there. Uh, suplex sends her right back outside of the ring. Matt's gonna go ahead and give her some more Ogre. Oh, a sharpshooter on the outside of the ring, but Ogre gets out of it. And we also have Sophie and Grizzly mixing it up. And the ref's not paying them no mind at all. Oh, Grizzly gets a power driver that seemed to be almost on the on top of the chair. And Ogre had the chair there. Seemed like she was about to give her a taste of some more chair. Oh, running a, a running attack right there. It seemed to be a, a, a shot with a, a, a fish shot. Uh, knee down to the head. Whoa, what was this? What's going on? Oh, wow. She did a double arm suplex over and she's dragging Grizzly. She's about to go for a pin, but Grizzly got back up. Oh, elbow to the back. Elbow. A club and blow to the back. This has been an excellent tag team match. Both teams have really left their mark on this one. Really showing that why they should be the tag team champions of the of Fighting Dreamers. Kick to the face. Ah, what a vicious backbreaker. It seems to be a modified one. I think she's, if I'm looking at her face card, I think she's busted open, ladies and gentlemen. I'm not sure. She may be. I'm not. But I do see, yeah, she's busted open. So, oh, a eye gouge. So he's busted open. You don't wonder how much left she had, how much she got left in the tank. Grizzly throws her into the corner, but she fell down. Grizzly panning into the crowd. The crowd does not like that. Kick to the gut. She falls back down again. What's she gonna do here? Uh, oh, rams her head to the. So we ran her head to the corner. She throws her. Oh, tree of woe. Hits her knees. Oh, very wisely hits her knees. An interesting way. A lot of wrestlers will go out to the knees of bigger wrestlers, which is actually a good idea. Oh, Ogre's like, you don't show off. Throws it out there to get Grizzly get a taste of her. Oh, this is gonna be a whoa, a tag team maneuver. It seems to be a combination of a double of a German suplex and an STO put together. Excellent teamwork by Ogre and Grizzly. Once in a more, we have some more chaos going on out there. Both teams really ready to brawl. I don't know why this wasn't a street fight. It seems they're ready to brawl on the outside quickly. It should be a street fight with Count Anywhere, for, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, Count with an elbow to the face, though, by Grizzly. Oh, wow! What's going on here? Rep calls it! Wow, Sophie knocks out Grizzly with a double arm power bomb. Excellent words. Sophie and Mackie are your winners in this tag team contest. A phenomenal match. And congratulations to Sophie and Mackie.
Um, here's our main event. We have Bond Bomber Kitsumugi versus Dark Star Chaos. This is for the Fighting Dreamers World Heavyweight Championship. Championship. Let's see who we got coming out first. We have the challenger for the title coming out first. It is Dark Star Chaos. And she is ready. It's, it's, she's, it's, she looks ready for action. And here comes our champion, Bama Kitsumura, or Kitsumura. But we have Bomber, but we're gonna just call them Bomber and Dark Star. That was an excellent tag team match, though. Phenomenal. Congratulations to all ladies. They really put a lot of effort into that match, but that was a brilliant match. The ref called it and said she knocked her out, which can happen in wrestling. Anyways, let's get rid of our, title, our championship match. We have that Neko referee back. She's back again for this title match. I'm gonna have to ask her after the show's over. Where, where did she get that outfit? It's very interesting. All right. Oh, a, a DDT right there by Dark Star Chaos or Dark Star. Oh, she tried, Bomber tried for a dragon, but she misses. A lockup. Oh. Oh, going for. Her. It's either a suplex, Dark Star Chaos, dropping her. Both women are pretty bigger, pretty, pretty, and pretty muscular. But I'm gonna have to give the edge to Dark Star Chaos in this matchup from just a personal viewpoint, visual viewpoint. She has more body mass and seems to be slightly taller than Bomber, so I expect her to try to overpower Bomber. Bomber gets her in a headlock. Bomber, Dark Star Chaos try to take a shot there. Bomber blocks. She kicked her to the a running kick to the gut. Bomber over another head. Misses with a shot. They lock up. Break even. Lots of locking up and breaking even tonight. It just show you how strong these ladies are. They don't back down from nobody. Very everybody here is all these ladies here in Fighting Dreamers are tough. And lock it up again. Breaking even. A shot. A chop to the chest. Bomber throws Dark Star into the corner. Dark Star says no. I'll give you a scoop slam though. Whoa, it seems she was going for something that seems like a fireball. Oh, wicked slap to the chest. Oh, going for a giant swing. Oh, nice. An excellent giant swing. Dark Star Chaos is not playing around. She wants that title. She wants that world title. I shouldn't say world heavyweight title since I, since I was just got word that it was just the world title. She wants that world title. She did some sort of fireball attack like she was Charizard from Pokemon. So she must Pokemon. Who knows, folks? Who knows? Oh, two hard shots to the head. Oh, a lineman tamer, it seems. That was excellent. Shades of the shade to the great Christian right there. A scoop slam by Bomber. Lock up. Oh, a release German suplex. One. Oh, Bomber over a pin. Just a one count, though. Oh, Rams are heading to the corner. Oh, Dark Star, Dark Star does the same thing. Woke up again. Going for a suplex out to the outside of the ring. Alright. Oh, a, a, a vicious forearm to the face. Throws her into the corner. Locks up. Su oh, puts her on top. Time for the most overused move of Rome Raiden. The superplex. On her head too. Ouch. Oh, a jumping DDT. Me Jane will be pleased. Lock up. A scoop slam. She's going on top, but she's gonna try. Oh, a, a leg drop off the top rope. Bomber showing she's not backing down. Showing why she is the champion. Whoa! I release Dreamer all the way to the outside. What a toss. Dark Star was a little dead, but she she gets back into the ring. She locks up, throws a forearm, locks up again, and does a DDT. Oh, 
He throws it into the ropes. Oh, and see, that was a buster. Going for another giant swing. And for some odd reason, the ref said that was a give up. I don't know. I don't think the ref. I, think, I don't know if the ref thinks. Uh, excuse me. I think the ref thought the giant swing was a submission hold. I think I had to tell her that also, besides what her out choice is all about. Oh, a headlock. Oh, punched right to the face. Oh, cover repair. One, two. A kick out right there by Dark Star Chaos. Or Dark Star. A Jeffy DDT right there by Bomber again. Uh, oh, a German suplex. That's going to be a break, though, because she's her foot's on the, or she was close to the road. Dark Star could have fireball, it seems. Missing once again. Oh, tosses on to the outside. Bomber down. She gets back up. She's getting right back in. Missed a shot. Ooh! A, 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 a heel kick, a nice kick to the face. As she went into a high leg boss grab. She once again tries for the fireball but misses. Oh, a very vicious kick to the back of the head. Oh, she was going to run out the road. We see Dr. Rick when she stops. When she, Bomber stopped wide. He stops herself. She goes, Trevor, Bomber tried, Dark Star tried for the suplex. Bomber blocked it and gave her a suplex of her own. Off the ropes. And a clothesline. Go for another cover in the pin. Two. A 2.9. Close. Oh, Dark Star tosses it into there. And a shoulder attack. And a shoulder tackle. She's coming off the ropes again. And an elbow drop. And. Uh, Chop to the chest. A lot, lots of whipping right there. Oh! A vicious hold. Ref has to give up. Right? Bomber said no when she popped out. Oh, drop toe hold. Dark Star. Oh, Dark Star blocked the kick. Uh, oh! A very quick release in Suplex. Both ladies are down. Both of them get back up at the same time. Toes them into the ropes. Oh, a shoulder tackle. Kicks her on while she's down. Bomber's not playing around. They lock up. Oh, a jumping DDT. Kick. And another kick. Stopping her on the ground, but she get the idea. Picks her up. Oh, locks her from the eye. Oh, it seems she was doing super, but they set her down and they kicked her in the back. Oh, what a vicious lock. Bomber says no, kicks her in the face to get out of that one. Oh, a slipper. Oh, oh no, it's into a... As Donald stretch, it seems. Luck. Oh, Spine Buster! Vision Spine Buster by Dark Star right there. Coming off the ropes. Oh, what a. It's threw a body right at her. I go over a go behind. Regular counters are going to a jump suplex. One, two, three! We have a. Regular Bomber retains her title. Not Rako, excuse me.